I'm really excited to show off for you this new feature we've got coming in Zoomit called Demo Type. It's a feature I've wanted forever because when I do demos, I create a Notepad file with the text in that file, and as I'm doing the demo, we'll flip to Notepad, copy the next chunk of text, flip back to the IDE or browser, and then paste the text. This is not only clunky, but it actually makes it clear that I'm not typing, which kind of removes some of the live demo flavor of what I'm doing. With Zoom at Demo Type, you can create a text file full of the pieces of text you want Zoom it to type in for you when you hit a hotkey. And I've got an example file here. It's got two chunks of text. It's separated by this end tag. This first chunk of text is some code. And you'll notice that despite the fact that I've got indents here that would get screwed up normally because IDEs like VS Code will uh, try to auto indent. I don't have to worry about that because Zoomit will compensate. The second chunk of text is similar but has paste tags around it. And that means that instead of typing it in, Zoomit will simply paste it in. One other thing about the typing is that Zoomit can either type it in itself at a speed that looks like typing speed that you can set, or you can drive the text in yourself by typing on the keyboard. And that adds even an extra air of live demo. Let's go take a look at that in action by flipping over to VS Code. I'm going to hit the demo type hotkey and then start typing. And as I type, I'm just typing random stuff. It looks like I'm typing in the input. Let's create another cell, hit demo type hotkey again, and there we get our paste. And so that is demo type. Stay tuned to sysinternals.com for the release of Zoomit with demo type.